Welcome to the second episode of How To. I will be showing you how to cut an onion. In my first episode, I told you all that I was <laughs> scared to cut an onion. I'm like, how do you get something cute out of something round? You know, when um, we're uneducated and we're ignorant, which is what ignorance is, that we tend to let things get the best of us and we let failure overcome. So we just cut off the ends of the onion, go straight down. That way, you can just go ahead and easily peel. You usually want to take off the first and second layer. You can take off the first, it depends on the cuts that you're trying to get in, what you're actually putting it in, but I just like to get a clean half of an onion with no greenery, because if you don't pick off that uh, first layer, you will get greenery. I don't have my bucket, so I'm just going to let these pile over here, and this, since it's just a little bit, it's okay for the bruise will be on your cutting board um, as long as it's contained in only a little bit. You still want to keep uh, your cutting board clean. So we have two halves here. So now that we have these halves, we're going to try to angle this board. That way you can see these cuts. So if you cut here and here, and we're going to be cutting here, here, and here. So we're going to be cutting here, here, straight down, straight down, straight down, straight down. And then we're going to go back over. That'll create perfect dices without you having to do too much. So we're going to hold it flat. That way we don't cut ourselves. And we're gonna go right in the middle and we're going to cut straight through one two and sometimes i do three on top because there is a round surface in what i call a heel so you see the two notches we have cut here i'm gonna go down one two three four five six and i count a lot you don't have to but you will um know why when you're cutting for you and or cooking for a while you just develop certain habits that help you do certain things or figure out certain things so if you can see the onion is still whole and I have like a little checkered board going on here so now as soon as I go straight down I'm already making my cuts now it's just up to me is how big I want them so I want small dice and I'm just going to go straight down that first cut you can see that they're already uniform and they're already cut up just by one slice this also um, keeps you from wasting time so I'm going to go straight down straight down straight down and this is the trick here I went straight down straight down straight down and then I flipped the last piece we still have our cuts here take those and go straight down that way the last piece is here and you have half of an onion cut and that's why uh, it's a little fast and efficient to do both cuts at the same time because it will make your speed a little faster at this point my eyes are burning. <laughs> it's a good thing. I'm used to it, but she still will cry. So I'm going to go ahead and get these bad boys in a bucket. And that is completes our second episode on how to cut an onion. Seems simplistic, seems even sometimes maybe what, a little basic amateur for certain people, but trust me, it will make your life easier, makes your dishes more pretty, uh, because people can see the cuts in their food, and uh, it also makes for um, nice dishes.